Somehow the microphone got turned off. Thank you, Kim. Oh, okay, so what I was saying to the Instagram viewers that are probably wondering what the heck is going on. We can't see you. So right. we'll, we can't comment on your comments. So we'll comment on them later. Yeah, we could either be backwards and see you or be... Right, and our shirts have writing, and so it would be off. So, you know, it's y'all, y'all. Hmm. You know everything has to be perfect when it's up here with the wig chicks. <laughs> oh, and that's why we have perfect hair on today. That's what right. have you got on, and what did you make me wear? Well, this is, Carrie made you wear that. This is a classic Gabor wig. I don't even know what the name of it is. I don't even know how old it is. But it is vintage. It's here's the tag. It's it's a vintage wig. Um, it's called S twenty five CT. Okay. But isn't that awesome? We still have the tags for it. But we decided it looked like who? David Lee Roth. David Lee Roth. I mean, it's crimped. I mean, it's got some major crimping. Did anybody have a crimper back in the day? I did. This has got some crimping going on. This looks like you did it and like slept on it for two days. And there you go. And Corey says it's like vintage Tammy Wynette. I, yeah, this is David Lee Roth. I mean, I'm expecting a tune to come out of those lips here any minute. <laughs> Maybe a guitar solo. Did he play the guitar? He sang. Well, I knew he sang, but did he play the guitar too? I don't think so. Oh, there's <sighs> Ontario, California. I'm, I'm wearing, okay, y'all got to know what this is. We have um, a few dancers. Connie Holly's coming in Saturday. Yes, she is. We have a few dancers. And this was done especially for one of the dancers who did um, cats. So this is a wig that we just made kind of crazy. It's, it's a Coco. By Noriko. I'm sorry, Renee, Renee Paris. Paris. Let me show you that. I mean, it's crazy. And then her mom sewed some ears in. Y'all, it's just cute. We just thought we'd have fun today. So what lipstick well, are you Well, we have wearing? fun every day. We do have fun every day. Um, mold wine and Mystic Berry gloss. Y'all could have guessed that gloss because she loves her some Mystic Berry. I have on Fly Girl and Red Glitter. But anyway. All right. So that's. We're here because it's Coffee Talk Week. Y'all, yep. look at these adorable cups. It says, it's official. You're awesome. And that's the way we feel about all of y'all. Cheers. Frank. So, coffee talk. We thought it'd be fun because it's, you know, it's always a good time for coffee. Germany's here. Hi, Germany. Guten Tag. Mm. It's nighttime. Well, it's seven there. All right. So, what are we going to do? I mean, obviously, it's Halloween week. So, we thought we'd start this week with some fun. So, these are, um, you know, I probably won't wear this all day. Although, I've kind of gotten a little attached to it. I feel like I'm walking around in a Snapchat filter. Well, I got to tell you... Yes, okay, Mimi says it's like the wig you used to wear. We were wondering about this because Carrie had it in her theater closet from back when she first started working here. Yes, and we are like, yeah, Mimi probably wore that wig. Well, now we know. Mimi did wear that wig. Yeah. So we even had some coffee cake. Did you tell me a coffee cake? No. You told me I couldn't eat all my coffee cake before we went live. But it I was, told her she's bullard in It's good. Mm -hmm. It's good. Anyway, uh, anyway, I wanted to trim the bangs. They're all in my eyes. They're hurting my eyes. I was able to get Carrie to put a root in it because it just... Because she just can't stand to look like David Lee Roth. She has to look pretty. <laughs> no. P pretty. Pretty. <laughs> <laughs> You're so dumb. <laughs> I am dumb. I admit it. I freely admit it. You know, it's it's life is better when you can laugh at yourself. It is. Tanya says it's cold and rainy there. Okay, so we think it's cold and rainy here. And I realize a nor'easter in Maine is a different <laughs> cold and rainy. But, I mean, it was 65 degrees this morning and rainy. <laughs> I know. And I got wet because I had to go on Target. And I was like, I need a jacket. But I didn't get one. So, <laughs> someone asked what lip scents I'm wearing. I'm wearing Fly Girl with red glitter gloss. And if y'all have not seen some of those new colors and lip scents, they're amazing. They are. They are. Um, you can see on our Facebook page the... I think I even put them on Instagram, too, the, all the colors we have in stock. So, and then you just give us a call and we'll order them. Yeah. Okay, but speaking of Instagram, if you haven't liked our Instagram page or followed us on Instagram, you need to follow us. We're trying to really build that, so we're doing a big push to Instagram right now. So, don't forget that. And um, our handle, I'll just go ahead and show you right now, 
is at Mimi's Wig Chicks. We had a winner. I was going to pull up that picture. We had a winner for last week's Lavish Waves, and she posted a picture in the Wig Chicks group on Facebook. So if you haven't seen it, you should go see it. Carla, we, yeah, we can put a, a root in one of your older wigs. Just let us know. This coffee cake's pretty good. Yeah, Jerry Bon Jovi would work also. I know, but what song did I start singing? <laughs> Sammy Hagar. She starts singing, I can't drive 55. I'm like, yeah, well, that's Sammy Hagar. He never had the hair. You know, song. I was so young in the 80s that I just, you know, it's okay if I get it wrong because, you know. <laughs> All right, let's just, on that note, let's just do our coffee thing. Okay. I don't want to take it off. That was so cute. So, we decided it would be fun to do coffee colors. So, we're going to do a whole bunch of styles. I think we have about 15 wigs. Um, I did not make the little things that go at the top because it's all about color. It's not about style. So if you see something you like, um, write it down. And we can't really respond sometimes to um, someone that just says, oh, what are you wearing now? Because somebody may have just jumped on and be at the beginning instead of live. So Right, and there's delays. And, and I will stuff. always, always, it might take me an hour, but I will always on the YouTube description underneath the video list out everything that we had on and have a timestamp. So... You can just go. All right, right stand up. They want to see our shirts. Oh, oh mine yeah. Says cuddles and coffee. Well, mine says, "I don't rise and shine. I caffeinate and hope for the best," <laughs> which is the honest truth. My sister bought me this shirt because she knows me so well. All right, oh. we're gonna start with "On Fire" by Raquel Welch and Ice Latte Macchiato. Hi, Tom Thumb, North Pharmacy. Oh no, hi it's Frisco, not Tom Thumb. Oh, that's Miss Janet. Coffee. Beth says she likes our t-shirt. Okay, so I got mine at Walmart in the pajamas section last year. I got mine. I was scrolling through Facebook a, like two or three years ago. I don't know. And I didn't even really remember this, but my I, I shared it and my sister just bought it for me because she's just sweet like that. So this is on fire. It's on fire. Large. Lace front, mono top, uh, in store only. You cannot buy this wig online. Ice Latte Macchiato. And it is a heat defiant fiber. Yes, yeah, super cute. A lot of people ask for that um, Jane Fonda kind of look. And this is the one that I feel like goes the best. Of course, the colors could be different, but Ice Latte Macchiato on fire. Like a little bit longer version of Sky. Again, you have to write it down. Oh, and Shelly's going to be a ninja at the church trunk or treat. Well, I'm not going to say what I'm going to be because y'all just might see it before then. It would be a surprise. Because I have a church trunk or treat, and this is the first year I've done a trunk. Would Melissa you? says that you didn't show you, you, this would have been way too much hair for you. Which one? The on fire for Melissa Turn. Oh. Yeah. But try it. You're about to be back in here. Alright, this is unfiltered in uh, Java. Is that I can't read that. Ice Java. Ice Java. How do you like your coffee? Everybody like making the comments like how you like yeah. your coffee. Especially on Instagram. That's good. I love my unfiltered. This is my favorite color in unfiltered right here. I've worn this many times. <laughs> love it. <laughs> Carol says she's answering her door this year dressed as a witch. Last year I was a female dog. Rhymes with witch. <laughs> That's me every day. <laughs> that is not true. Well, some just, days it is. Monday just, it was that. I don't know what was wrong me with me Monday. You, with me? No, with me. I was just in a foul mood. Oh, I didn't even notice. She says that now. Certainly did what I was told, but. <laughs> All right, this is straight up with a twist. Raquel Welch, lace front, mono top, heat defiant fiber. This is a new color that they came out with this year called Iced Sweet Cream. It is very, very light platinum blonde. 
the color number on this is RL1622. Love that. This Straight is up a the great twist. classic style. It works for a lot of people. It's not too much hair. And this color filled a real need for people who want that platinum without going quite so yellow. Um, or who didn't want the low light of the biscuit. Oh, 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 oh. What? Where is my birthday card? It's in the green folder. That oh, says I got... I don't want to offend anybody in my family, but I'm telling you, I got the best, most special birthday card I've ever gotten in my whole life. It was so cute. Kim's birthday is tomorrow, y'all. Tomorrow. Is that in the green folder? The green one that says shout outs. I st okay, Sweet I'm going to digress cream. for just a minute. Here, you can put that on because i got to tell my story. Okay, well, just let me preface. The next three are all called Iced Mocha, but for three different companies. So we wanted to show you the comparisons. So there's these two sweet girls in Alaska that I've become friends with through Week Talk Wednesday. And this little girl made me a card, and so I have to show it to everybody. It says, Happy Birthday, Miss Kim. Oh, can you see it? And she's drawn all these fall leaves, and she put 56, and she puts a little note here that says leaves. So cute. And then inside she wrote, awesome to have a girl who's having a birthday, because mine was one month ago. This is so spectacularly infinite. <laughs> I hope, I hope you, you do well, I hope you do well on your job. That's still out. I hope she does well on her job, too. Oh, by the way, my mom and I, my mom sends greetings. She watches you all the time. Sincerely, Irene, and oh, and then she just names all the whole family. But she sent me a picture. Uh, she has um, sent me actual photos of these uh, snowmen that she makes. And they're all, like, different, like a, a walrus and different characters. And then she drew me pictures of a dog and all kinds of stuff and then on the back she says p.s this is the exact suit i had on when i was making this card is that, that just cute? is that I the cutest that. thing in the whole world love it, it, just, love it, love it was it. so special and then her mom sent me a beautiful card so anyway it just it just made my it made my wink all right i'm sorry i just had That's to tell right. that what this is, is that zane by Noriko, part of their new collection, and this is the Iced Mocha R, so just a good, a medium brown with a good highlight to it. So why don't you put on the next Iced Mocha? Okay. And we'll compare. Love Zane. Love the length of this. Love the movement. Love the side sweat bang. I just love everything about Zane and Meadow. Harley, a little too long for me, but I love that new collection they just put out. Okay, so this is Avalon by Aesthetica in I Smoka, and there's three companies, there's probably more, but that say I Smoka, and so sometimes if you're new to wig, well, even if you're not new to wigs, it can get confusing about which I Smoka you're talking about. So this is part of their coffee collection that came out, I don't know, like a year ago, and kind of ombre, kind of ombre, balayage kind of look. So you can see our color side by side. Whereas the Noriko definitely has a dark brown with a highlight running all the way through it. So let's switch. We haven't switched. Well, we have. And this is Finn. Did you say it was Finn? No, I said it was Avalon. Oh, I th <laughs> this is Finn. Yeah, it's. I'm sorry. <laughs> Like, I don't remember you saying Finn. And that's because you didn't. Terry's birthday Saturday. Oh, I, I love this wig. Terry. And Maxine looks so cute in this wig. Maxine is like you. She looks cute and everything. Love, love, love. Oh, my Amazon just got here. That's for my trunk or treat. Well, it might be my Amazon. Oh, no, I see it. Mine's in a big long box. Well, I, we fight over Amazon packages because we have one coming just about every day. Oh, the highlights are cool, okay? 
It's a really nice cool tone, which is kind of different because the base of it has a little bit of a gold undertone. But yeah, I would still consider Ice Mocha a cool color. Okay, and this is in charge by Raquel Welch in the shadow shade Ice Mocha that they make, which is uh, came out with their new cool collection. I, I want to say years that's ago. A, yeah, a year Maybe ago, two. January. So you really... <laughs> Beth just asked if that was my mm -hmm. broomstick that arrived. That's right, Beth. It's not mine. <laughs> it's hers. Beth, have I told you that you're awesome? I like Beth. I like them all, but, you know, Beth's real sweet. She, she came to visit us. So this is in charge. I have two of this style. I love this style. I do, too. In charge is a and really, you really popular And you really, you don't see, the, the highlights are very, very blended. So in this eye smoke, it looks a lot more monochromatic than what the other two do. Uh, Corey from Facebook just made a comment. She's like, please tell Noriko and instead I could do a light ash blonde like Palm Springs blonde. They really kind of do. Um, Aesthetica does the um, Silver Sun Root. Silver Sun Root. Um, and then in Noriko, they just came out with that seashell blonde, which is not quite as highlight low light as the Palm Springs or the seashell blonde, but it's really light without a gold tone. It's really pretty, but they're only making it in like three styles. Susan's asking about the shorter bob I had on. That was straight up with a twist. In charge is just a good... Oh, in California, wig. they're going to start letting them try wigs on in uh, November. Oh, well, that's good. Wow. Cute, cute. Okay. Moving right along. I don't want to damage Colleen says paper. she's blessing my sweet toe, y'all. Thank you for all this oh, but toe she's blessings. Oh, time with her toe. Bless her heart. Bless my little old heart. Okay, now we're going to do Misty's favorite. Wait, well, one of them. Mm -hmm. This is Starly in Kahlua. Which Kahlua is not technically a coffee, but you put it in your coffee sometimes. So we threw it in there because we didn't have any Tony Beverly's. Lisa Marie's here. Him. Presley? Presley. So Kahlua has some uh, pretty gold highlights to it. It's got a nice medium brown color. You know, Starling's yeah, Starling's A little bit more on the gold side of Caramel Kiss. And I know Danielle just posted um, she wears the Caramel Kiss Starly. Mm -hmm. And she also got the 12 is 28, which looked great. Did you see her cut her bangs? On the Jolie? Yes, yeah, she did so and good. And she got a hump. I mean, she, she did, did so great. good. So if you wonder what we're talking about, you got to go on our YouTube, uh, Facebook the Week witch Chicks. VIP group. Yes. But I love Starly. I cut bang in my Starly. Probably about 90% of the wigs that we sell on Starly, we cut bangs in. But it looks great without it. You should get a toe ring after all you're going through. You used to have a toe ring. Didn't you? Oh, probably. I'll just be happy if I get a toenail. Thank you guys for all the birthday wishes. I appreciate I've it. I've already started, like, researching... Toe tattoos. <laughs> In case I don't get a toenail again, they make it look just like a nail, which I'm never going to do that. But you know, I'm like, I can stick something on there. Surely some E6000. <laughs> Starly. Super glue. <laughs> oh, you know what? They sh I should invent this, which they may already have. Um, like one of those things that I hung all my pictures with them. What are they called? Why don't you get those stretchy things? Why don't Command you get strips. a toe piercing? Like with a big no. flower. Are you kidding, Kim? <laughs> that just makes me want to throw up. If you knew how much pain I've been in. She doesn't, you she doesn't feel my pain, you can tell. She wouldn't even joke. About I'm that. telling you, I've had every orthopedic injury you can imagine and they make fun of me about how I oh, walk. I don't. I've been on crutches. I've been, Marcia. <laughs> I've been on Marcia crutches. Marcia, come here. <laughs> I've had leg braces had all kinds of stuff. All right, this is Dance by Ellen Villa. This is called Espresso Tip. I love this way. Love it. And it's hard to see um, from a distance, but you really can see the tips are just a little bit lighter. So yeah. it's it's like you almost have like a lived in or grown out color. Yeah, it, and the thing is, if you've got color on your hair, 
Let me try to pull it. Up it's here gonna so you can fade. See. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you can Isn't definitely it see it. Isn't cute? Oh, it's just so cute. I may have to have this. I say that about everything, don't I? Well, coffee. Remember the Saturday? Was it Saturday Night Live that did the coffee talk? Coffee. Coffee? Coffee. You know, they were Jewish New Yorkers and they had their little talk show and it was so cute. I don't know. They probably still have it on there every now and then because sometimes they bring back the throwbacks. You know what I know that they don't have? What? Gingerbread pumpkin cake at Corner Bakery anymore. I know. Y'all, if anybody has had the Corner Bakery, the little bunt that's like they it used to be pumpkin then they changed it to gingerbread pumpkin and this year they don't have it at all so if you know what i'm talking about and you have a recipe that is close to that would you just please send it to me or if you can find a copycat recipe i can't find anything and that's all kim asks for every year for her birthday so she don't get it but i'm getting max's donuts from alan yes that's what she wanted so all I'm right go get them this is orchid in Vanilla Macchiato. So it's got that long root going and then super, super pretty. Yeah. Long root. I love this. Not thing. technically an ombre, but it's just so, so pretty. Okay, and this one. Who knew there were so many coffee colors? This, this out, yeah, it's got the dark root even at the. It does, one? but then they have that other color that has that dark underneath the silver yeah. sun. And what's it called? I can't remember. It's not a coffee color, so we didn't show it. Yeah, it's going to drive me crazy. It's not a long drive. That's the truth. Sometimes when I say it's going to drive me crazy. Oh, Michelle, it's, it's Michelle's birthday today. Happy birthday. Oh, these, oh, I see. Thank you, Corey. I see shadow. Yes, I see shadow. Our camera's up a little high today. I didn't set it right. Cute. Cute, cute. Okay, this really is Avalon. Is it? Are you sure? I read the box. Okay. Avalon. I love Avalon. I'm exactly one week younger than Jerry. This is Toffee Latte. Well, she, you're a little younger than Marsha too, and um, you don't ever hesitate to remind her of that. That's right. Yeah, Avalon's beautiful. This is a nice honey kind of dark blonde ombre look. Well, and I like this one. It's the base is not quite so dark as some of the others, and so it's a little bit easier to wear. Uh, but it's a it's a beautiful deep rich dark brown. Miss Michelle says have one her favorite wig. Oh, sorry, I hit the microphone. We're almost to twenty thousand on YouTube. No, oh, that's exciting because we're going to do something. If you're big. watching from Facebook and you haven't subscribed to YouTube, shame on you. Yes. We need you. Yes, Misty does look beautiful in Norkid, doesn't she? I love this wig. And Aesthetica is such a comfortable cap. So comfortable. Donna has Orchid and Toffee Latte. I bet that's pretty. <laughs> this would be my hair if I had good hair. Beth just cracks me up. Why would she say? She said they when I hit the microphone that she thought they were having an earthquake. <laughs> Sometimes it feels like we're having an earthquake up in here when I hit this desk. All right, this is Rosie by John Renault. This is shaded mocha. So it's a nice warm gold color. Very popular color. It's yeah. Nice dark blonde. And like a natural. That to me looks like a, like a natural blonde. Yeah. A little bit of a shadow root. Rosie's kind of a sometimes forgotten style. And it works. It's just a good length. It's a lace front mono top. Uh, it, if you compare this to like Cameron, which is fully hand tied, this um, has a few more layers down here. So it's going to be a little bit flippier than uh, Cameron. But... It is the mono top it, and the lace front. It's not fully hand tied. Mm -hmm. Rosie. Rosie the Riveter. Oh, Char 
says she didn't get our notification. Well, have you turned on your notifications? I mean, because I didn't get <laughs> one either, actually. Moonstruck's still in the title. I know. I know. That's what I said at the very beginning. I'm sorry. I didn't change the titles. I forgot. I'll change it in a minute. Moonstruck was last week. Yeah, and, you know, I have a checklist that I sometimes check off and I sometimes don't. Today I didn't. We were having too much fun between David Lee Roth and the cat wig. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was having a lot of fun. Yeah, we were having fun. All right, this is January in Mocha Truffle. And this color is 1BRH30. So it is black, which is one, and then 30 is red. And so it's got, I'm going to see if I can show you these highlights. Got some pretty copper highlights. Shauna, it's, um, you can call, we're here 10 to 4 Monday, well, we're here longer, but we take actual phone calls 10 to 4 Monday through Friday and 10 to 3 on Saturday. And our number is 972-380-5306. She's just asking when's a good time of the day to call. Yeah, um, Carolyn, that's what Misty was saying in the beginning. We we did not put the titles after we're done. She will date and timestamp every single one that will have the color and the style. Right, Lindsay, I, I will fix it. I know you said it makes it confusing, but I promise I will fix it. There's just so many little things to do, I can't always remember them all. Oh, well, I thought you were having too much fun. What is it? Are there too many details, or were you having too much fun? A little bit of both. <laughs> I love me some January. Oh Which I still haven't figured out what color I'm going to get. Because I wore mine out. Okay, all right. This is Sky by Noriko. No, this is a classic style that they've been making for years. They will never get rid of this. If you watched um, this morning, we posted a little short video of our first client of the day who came in from Colorado, and she wore her sky out in creamy blonde. So if you want to see sky. Beautiful. So this is called I know Cappuccino. Lin I know, Lin Lindsay says, I wasn't claiming. I know you weren't, girl. <laughs> I got you. But if anybody else saw it, I just want to say, I promise I will fix it. I promise. Cute, cute, cute. Uh, Rhonda, yes. Noriko's caps do run smaller. They don't have as much stretch. I wear a wig called Jolie occasionally. And it's made by Noriko. And... <laughs> It is occasionally now. It used to be all that she would wear, and now she's, she's I've branched expanded. out. I, but I cut the bands out at the little bands that you tighten the wig with. I cut those out just so I can get more stretch and actually get it on my head. This is kind of fun doing colors. Yeah. And that way you, we can so, show lots of different styles versus just one or two styles. All right. This is Cameron by Renee Paris and Coffee Latte. Coffee Latte is such a pretty color. There's several different highlights running through it. You've got some warmth, kind of a darker red highlight. You've got a lighter highlight. Yes, and Renee Paris does coffee latte, and then Noriko does a coffee latte R, which has a little bit of a shadow at the root. Charlene um, from Facebook says she's new to wigs. What do you do for a widow's peak? I have a widow's peak. I just usually, if it's a lace front, I just try to get it as far back as I can without showing that. Um, but most of the time, I just got to where I don't worry about it too much because, especially if it has a little bit of a fringe bang, no one will notice it. Yeah. And I have even been known to, like, if, if my bangs match, I have a Kate in Chocolate Frost, which I used to wear all the time. And I would pull that out and, and pull it away if your color matches good enough. And I think someone just said they do that, okay. too. A, you can't... Okay. You shouldn't wash your wig in regular shampoo. Because it regular shampoo, even though for our own hair, you shampoo and you condition, regular shampoo has conditioners in it, and it will uh, weigh the hair down and make it dull. And Sue, you can alter a wig to oh make it gosh. smaller. We have a video on alterations. These bangs, do you know who these bangs are? If they were blonde, it's Colleen Todd. 
Yeah. She always has that pretty long bang that kind of comes out like that. She's so pretty. And this was the wig that I was going to wear until the David Lee Roth wig showed up today. Hi. This is Avalon in Americano. We actually have um, a couple of male clients who do tribute bands who we've done wigs for. We have... Um, what's on oh, we have today? Tom Petty. We have Tom Petty. Um, we've had several. I just can't remember. We've had Kiss. Uh, we've yeah, we, and that that's so much fun. It is fun. It's a lot of fun. All right, so this is Americano. I remember the first time I had an Americano. I didn't know what to order. I went to Starbucks. It was a long time ago when Starbucks first came on the scene. I'm like, oh, give me an Americano because it sounded you know something like, shoot. After that, I got to have some creamer <laughs> and some sugar. <laughs> I need a latte. Yeah, the brown, the brown and Americano is really, really dark. And so that's what I was saying about the toffee latte. The toffee latte is a bit easier to wear because the base color is not as dark as this. But it's so pretty. And it matches your eyebrows really good, Kim. Kim has that really pretty dark natural brow that I'm always jealous of because it matches all the wigs. Well, not all of them. That eye sweet cream. Well, yeah. <laughs> Not that one. Okay, what else? We have other things to talk about. Like what? I'm putting Rosie back on. Um, well, are we going to... Well, first of all, give an update. If you haven't seen our latest, latest update on the shop, it's, it's coming, y'all, soon. Yeah. So we have um, videos of that up. What else? They're installing cabinets on Tuesday was the latest update I got today. Um, the Americano, yeah, I mean, it's really, there's pieces that are super cool that do look gray. Um, I just have a question. This is for y'all, okay, because this has nothing to do with wigs. You know, Kim and I are always trying to buy the latest, greatest everything makeup-wise. <laughs> we just both ordered that Il Maquillage Foundation, and we think we might like it. So if anybody out there wears it... Let us know what you think and, and see. Because, I mean, I just tried it. I still love my good old sand buys my makeup forever. And um, even sometimes it cosmetics. But I just... Misty got the... I got the heaviest full coverage one. And so she wore my makeup today. I, I love it. I mean, it just seems to blend. And it's so funny because we matched two different times. I got mine like a week before hers. She obviously did hers away from me. We, we wear the same shade. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? And it looks completely and different. And I look so much more pale. It's just, anyway. So, anyway. I just want to know if anybody else wears that. Il Maquillage. Yes. You can actually try it for 14 days at no charge, but I'm, I'm going to keep it. Okay. Are we going to do, are we going to give anything away? Oh, yeah. We mm -hmm. are. I forgot about that. What do you want to do? Well, where are they? Well, I don't know. Oh, I'll tell you. Well, anyway, we are giving away in honor of Coffee Week. And it is, you know, it is the most popular beverage in the world. Oh, I did not know that. Yes. Well, it may not be. I, I thought just, it was I just lying. made that up. But, yeah. <laughs> I literally just made that up. Don't go fact checking me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded convincing, though, didn't it? It hey. sounds good. I mean, I could be a lawyer. Um, we are doing um, a, four giveaways. $25 Starbucks cards to four lucky winners. Um, this time, last week was a little bit more in-depth for the competition, which we appreciate you doing. It won't always be easy, okay? But this time, it's going to be easy. All you got to do is go on Instagram and like every post that we made in October. It's only like 20. Okay, so, all right. That's you got to like them all. And, and so, that's on, on Instagram. If you're going to like it, you hit the heart? The heart. Okay. Yes. So, you go on Instagram like our posts you can go to our page there's 20 the very first one you can look for it is the picture i posted of kim in germany standing outside the ellen villa retail store so start there like them all and so this is going to run through friday at noon and we will announce the four winners how will we do that I think we're going to go live. On Friday. On Friday. Are y'all ready for that? We are really <laughs> changing things up. I'm telling you, it is like a madhouse in here. I can't even control these people. Doreen, our number on the makeup was 35. 035. 035. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to go live on Friday. So you need to set your alarms and be here on Friday. 
because we're going to go live from 12 to 1 and just have some fun. We have no agenda. We don't, we're not going to show you anything. Well, we might, but we're just going to hop on here and have some fun because it's going to be Kim's birthday celebration since we're all going to be here on Friday. Friday, it'll be at noon, Beth. Same yes, Friday. Friday at noon, Central Standard Time. And then we'll announce all four winners. Actually, we're going to have five. We're going to have six winners. Okay. We're going to have four Starbucks gift cards. And two, we'll get these cute little mugs that we found that we just fell in love with. So we bought a couple extra just to give away because you are awesome. And um, the winner of those will be chosen for anybody that places an order on our online store from now until Friday at noon will be entered into a drawing for that. And when we go live on Friday, are we going to do YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook? I don't know. Well, someone's asking. Probably. I don't know. For sure, YouTube. For sure. Um, Lori, I got my sweatshirt at Walmart in the pajama department a year ago. It may have been two years ago. But I, every year, they have some cute coffee stuff. And I threw the pants out, but I love the sweatshirts. I, the, I'm I telling it. you, I have bought pajamas everywhere. Every year, I buy pajamas at Walmart because they are so soft and comfortable. I love them. I have some cute ones last year for stars. Anyway. Okay, so, to win the Starbucks gift cards, just to reiterate, Instagram, like every post. And when you've got that for the done, month of yes, when you've got that done on the very last post that we make for until Friday, you got to comment done. And then we're going to go and we're actually going to check it. You've got to make sure you're doing it right. And so uh, four people will get um, $25 Starbucks gift cards. And then these cute little mugs, which we'll put a special message on for you. Um, we'll be, we have two of those to give away for online orders, which is shopmimisdallas.com. Any order from now until Friday at noon, and that is any amount. You don't have to buy a wig. You can just order whatever. Yeah. I and mean, you get a cute little mug, and then next time we have coffee talk, you can grab your mug and match us and have coffee, which mine's really cold now. She wants to know, can we like, can you like more than once? No, just once. Because if you like it twice, it unlikes it. Yeah, and right. you just get one entry. So last week we had like four different ways to win. So all now right. we've said all that to say this. What's the wig of the week? The wig of the well, you just happen to have Ro Rosie on. I did, so I Renaud. put this back on. We're gonna do Rosie, which we haven't done in a while, and we're gonna get ready because John Renault's got a new collection coming out. If you haven't noticed our post on that, Susan is asking if we ever answer questions here. We do, um, but they scroll so fast. So if you have a specific question, email us at mwigboutique at gmail dot com, yes. and then we'll respond if you if you need the specific question or answer uh, we're certainly here to help you yes so wig of the week really quick the promo code is um always wow 15 let me just pop an image up here really quick i don't know if i didn't change that it's wow 15 sorry i don't have the image yet and it gets you 15 percent off any rosy any color you must put it in the promo box not the comment section our system doesn't allow us to go in and change your order. I mean, it's secure, so you don't want us to be able to go and change your order. But uh, you've got to put it in the promo box before you hit complete your order. Yes. Is that it? Oh. There's something else? Is there anything new coming out? Well, I just said that John Renault's getting a new collection. Yeah. Is there anybody else? Ellen Phillips. Act two. Act two. As soon as we've got them, you will see them. Yes, always watch, and we will um, show what we're, hopefully, in time to show what we're going to do on right. Wednesday. But if you miss us live, you can always. The rosy that Missy has on, the color is 24BT18S8, also known as Shaded Mocha. And rosy does not come in a large cap. If you're looking for a similar style that does come in a large cap, check out Cameron by John Renault. Cameron is 100% fully hand tied. The styles are pretty similar. Uh, Rosie just has a little bit more layering down in this area. Do you know what I'm most excited about when we get our new place? Huh. I mean, I'm really excited that we're going to have a room to do this in. And I told Carrie, if y'all have seen Carrie, but anyway, she needs to video all this before it's gone yeah. about how we get ready for Wig Talk Wednesday. And I know people think, oh, you just hit a button and it's done. Oh, no. But what I'm most excited there's about. There's and eye rolls. When, and yeah, there's lots of huffs and eye rolls. But when we get our new place and everything's set up permanently, we can hop on live anytime we want. Yeah. 
Now, that's the reason we only do it once on Wednesday is because it's just a major ordeal. I'm excited about that. All right. Well, I hope everybody has a wonderful week. Thank you for joining us today. And we'll be back on Friday. Cheers. <laughs> Enjoy an extra cup of coffee. Yes.